got to talk about Black Hammer. The old Nazi condo. The old anti-Semite. The old everybody's, everybody's least favorite Marxist anti-Semite. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. And I can tell you, this is some ethically sourced drama. Let me tell you what. Oh, and it's fresh off the presses. No one has talked about this. I am the only one who's going to have been talking about this. Well, this is not 100% correct. Whatever. We'll make it work. This will have to do. <sighs> you know what I like more than seeing my seeing people I think are bad doing badly? When two people that I think are bad um, are doing badly because of each other. <laughs> that's the only thing that's better than one person I don't like doing badly. It's two people. Okay. So now, for those of you who don't know, okay, Black Hammer is a revolutionary anti-colonial leftist organization okay and i'm going to show you something about black hammer just uh let me just show you some some little little fun times okay because we did a whole segment we did a whole segment on black hammer but this is really the fun stuff Okay, you can sign up at the Mao level today for $199 minimum reparations. Sign up for an entire eight week boot camp to get fully certified as someone who is united under colonized leadership. By completing this level, you'll get the chance to provide your skills to the organization and be an active recruiter to make sure that other people are continuing to pay their reparations. You get to go crack some knees break some thumbs and support the masses of poor and working class colonized people upon completion you'll also receive a reparations core uniform you know, nice t-shirt boost your mal level you can get a a mal plus oh we got the sankara level 99 dollars minimum sign up for the four-week boot camp and get halfway there to falling under the leadership of colonized people you won't be able to unless you buy into the Mao level. Shea level. Sign up for a single lesson of the boot camp and get a view of the experience work it takes in order to disunite with your people's worldwide acts of genocide and terror. Oh! Oh! For $9.99, for nine easy payments of $9.99, you too can be a part of the revolution. Now you all know that I fucking can't stand these people. I can't stand people who do this shit. But, but, it's one thing to LARP as the revolution while selling a product to your probably well-meaning but stupid followers. There is one, it's one thing. But, <laughs> but it gets even worse because Black Hammer has a really bad history with anti-Semitism. And I mean, like, really, really bad history with anti-Semitism. Now, we covered this on my stream, so I'm not going to go in depth. But you can go watch the segment I did on the woke ethnostate of Black Hammer in the past. See, recently, Black Hammer re-entered the news... Because they've been doing this project, okay? Which is still being advertised on their website. Hammer City. Oh, shit. Look at this. Oh, my God. This is what Hammer City is going to look like. This is a, uh, a digital rendition of what their city is going to look like. Yeah. Let's take a look. Let's look up close. Oh, shit. We got some round uh, what looks like mud buildings we got a um what appears to be a uh a coliseum i don't really know what this purpose of the coliseum is here but there is we got a nice big donate 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 we got this uh questionably photoshopped top and you know you got your nice little villages and whatever now this hammer city is 
building a city for all people of color to be free, jobs, housing, food, healthcare, no rent, no coronavirus, and no white people, returning the land to indigenous people, building the first hammer city in Colorado, back this product. Now their goal is $500,000, that's pretty major. And they're already at 70,000. But my lovely imps, there is an issue. There's an issue. And none of it really has to do with any of the principles or the problems of buying land in a mountain from probably a colonizer, quote unquote, a colonizer, and and reclaiming it for yourself, for your organization, not not actually for indigenous people, just for your organization that you claim serves indigenous people. Because as it turns out, they might not be being completely honest. Now, remember how I said there were two groups involved in this that I don't like? How many people here like the police? Huh? Anybody a big fan of the police? Anybody? Anybody a big fan of the police? Nah. We're in, I don't think anybody here is a fan of the police. Hey, thanks for the money, Robert Dunn. Oh. Thanks for the money. Appreciate that. Oh, Zanny, Zanny Dragon. Sorry, that will... Um, Zanny Dragon, just D DM me on Discord if you can, please. I won't be able to remember this on here. I will absolutely send that to you. Just DM me on Discord. All right. So... <clears throat> Nah, looks like looks like we got a a a, a time honored cr tradition of not liking, still not liking the police. But the police have had a bit of a run in with Black Hammer, and as a result, there's been some concerning revelations that have come to the surface. Allow me to break the story for you. Thank you to you know who you are, who sourced this story for me. And I have verified this. We got it archived. San Miguel County Sheriff. Deputies responded Monday evening to a trespass report on a property south of Norwood, where a group of eight to 12 people from the Black Hammer organization were camping prior to a property purchase that never, that ultimately did not occur. When deputies arrived, they advised the group of the trespass, and then they left the in area without incident. Deputies found some individuals were legally armed and posing no threat to f public safety. There have been no reports that the group has since been seen in the area. The Black Hammer organization states on its website that it is a revolutionary mass organization dedicated to building a sustainable future for all colonized people worldwide. Angel Brad, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for supporting my show, not the revolution. I appreciate that. I am not the revolution. I'm just a showmaker, okay? <laughs> Well, not nothing happened. Because what we found out from this is that contrary to their previous claims, they don't actually own the land that they bought to return to colonized people. And f in fact, I don't even know if they've got the money for it. And so instead, Hammer City was being built on land that they stole. The irony is somewhat shocking, is it not? When you when you colonize some la some some land that you don't own, to prove that you're not the colonizers, in the name of Native Americans, so you can um, do your anti-Semitism 
on a mountain. I don't know. Like I said, I'm no fan of the police. I'm no fan of anti-Semites. So when the police and the anti-Semites go like this, and then we get a juicy treat out of them going, I don't know. You know, I, I don't know, it just feels real, it feels really good. <laughs> I love this comment. Damn, my guess was that, was that this was an FBI front group rather than a scam artist ex-YouTuber turning kids into strasserists and taking their money. I guess it could be both. <laughs> Does this mean I won't have to pay my Hammer City parking tickets? <laughs> they claim to have 200 acres and they're building a group that will take out people that they don't like. Uh, looks like it's not gonna happen after all. Hey, at least they put down a nice plank. That's a very cozy plank. These guys were a scam, and any of you taking them or their politics seriously are wasting your time. The commies aren't coming for your bodily fluids. They're just grifters. True! Yo, for revolutionaries, they sure as hell didn't put up much of a fight for the land they liberated. Get off my lawn! Oh! Oh, no! Oh, no! Three guesses as to what happened to the money that was raised for that purchase. We don't need three guesses. I don't even think we need one guess. We already all know. We already all know. Oh, and by the way, as of yesterday, they are still raising money. They are still raising money. And it doesn't seem that they've informed their followers who are giving them money that this isn't working, that Hammer City ain't happening. Damn, Black Hammer. Maybe you should have gone a little lighter on the Anne Frank jokes. Maybe you should have burned less copies of the, uh, maybe if you're, maybe if the cops hadn't been able to see the, the smoke signal of you burning copies of the diary of Anne Frank, you wouldn't have gotten busted. You, you would have gotten away with it, too, if it wasn't for those meddling, billowing smoke clouds from the, the burned books of, of, of Jewish writers that we were burning. Yeah, embezzled? Oh, you know it was fucking embezzled. You know it was embezzled. Somebody bought a gold-plated fucking fleshlight with that shit. You know. Oh, you fucking know. And guess what? They're still grifting. Still grifting. Oh, oh, it gets worse. I just noticed. They're still accepting Bitcoin. Ah! <laughs> of course they are. Ethereum and Bitcoin. Of course they are. Oh, <laughs> When you when you use the e the magic Elon Musk m money so that you can embezzle embezzle from your Mao tier donors so that you can illegally colonize some land in Colorado and then when the cops ask you to stop you just leave. Oh, it's too good to it's too good. But. Oh, you think they're doing a little bit of a uh, false advertising here? Oh, look. Oh, look. They've got their cool houses. Hmm. Where are these, I wonder? Where the hell? Wait. Where the hell are these? I wonder. Are these just... Are these just photos of something somebody else built? What is this? Oh, are these members of Black Hammer? Or are they just taking random pictures of hardworking people and using them as props for their money embezzling stream? Yeah, let's 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 do that, shall we? Yeah, let's do it. Good idea, Grime Dango. Why don't we, out of curiosity, let's do a little let's do a little investigating, huh? Let's do a little investigating. Uh oh. Oh. 
Let's take a look. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Here we go. How do we do this here? Where's the fucking web search? Here we go. Go to Google Images. Here we go. Hmm. Hold on. Here we go. I gotta get the picture. Let me get this. Do 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 do. Ba da 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 da. What is this? Did that go in? Oh no, it's a web P. Can you use tin eye? Okay, we'll try. Here, let's try this. They only have a web P. Oh wait, here we go. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I have bad news for you folks. They just took a random picture from a fucking Pinterest page. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh god. Oh, it's from this fucking Pinterest page by an artist who designs these houses. They're from a modern tiny house movement. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, no. It gets worse. Oh, should we do it? Should we do it? Oh, no. Let's let's see. Is it going to be worse? Oh, it's going to be worse. It's going to be worse, isn't it? Let's find out. Hold on a second, everybody. Hang on to your fucking jorts. Oh! Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let's see. Okay. Now, hold on a minute. All right. Google was only able to find this particular image on on black hammer's website okay let's see yes they did grime dango but let's find out yeah let's 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 tin eye it let's tin eye it huh yeah let's find out let's give it a minute oh no oh no the first result it's a stock image from getty images i can't no it's a fucking stock image literally of a taco bell employee <laughs> that's the one Hammer City, Hammer City agent, agent Getty Images, agent Taco Bell Getty. Not only that, this is a staff image. This is, this is an image that was made by Getty Images. It's not even bought by Getty Images. Let's see how far this goes, shall we? Let's see how far this goes. All right, now this one. Ooh, ooh, uh-oh. Now this one. Hold on a second here. Now this one. Now this one is theirs. Oh, shit. This one's theirs. Colorado. Well, Colorado ain't happy with you right now. Looks like your Colorado shit ain't working. Let's see. Oh, shit. So, we've got images stolen from a Colombian artist. We got a $500 Getty Prime image. You know what's sad about this? You know what's the most sad part about this? This $500 image, that's more than like this lady makes in two weeks. And they're using her image they're using her image to fucking fund their grift. 
Isn't that sad? This is about Black Hammer, yeah. We're talking about Black Hammer. They bought it. They bought it. They bought it. Now, to be fair, they probably, judging by how low quality this image is, look at how low it is. They probably bought the 175 version, okay? They probably bought the 175. Yeah. Yeah, they cut out the Taco Bell bag. They could have. They could have. Listen, no matter how many Mao tier subscribers you have, <clears throat> Mao, Mao tier subscribers can't buy you genuine pictures of the working class who support your grift movement. Fortunately, damn, if only you'd added a higher tier, you could have gotten a high quality image. Maybe they should have added a, uh, maybe they should have added like a Xi Jinping or something. How many acres would you need to build a city? My neighbor has 200 acres and it takes a while to walk through it, but I don't think we could build a city there. I don't know, actually. I mean, it's not, I mean, Hammer City, I mean, that's ridiculous, right? Hold on. I just want you to like, I want you to think about something for a second, okay? Look, we're going to look at this again real quick. Do you think you can build a city in the mountains with farms for $500,000. Do you really? Should we check this image? It looks like Neopets? No, it can't be. It can't be. It can't be. Come on. That's 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 too much. No matches. Nothing. Nobody found this one. This is the only one. Okay? <clears throat> I think it's just shitty CG. Yeah. I think it's just shitty CG, everybody. Do you think that you can build an amphitheater like this for $500,000? Especially with a holographic logo. Oh, look. It's got a swimming pool. Wow, that's cool. Do you think you can get a swimming pool with all these buildings for $500,000? That will get you some piping and a road? True, goddess trans girl. Oh my god, it does! It does look like Neotopia! Or Neopia. Neotopia. <laughs> we are Black Hammer. We have taken the war to Neotopia. We are reclaiming it from the Neotopians. The Neopets will feel the wrath of Black Hammer. Look at what they took from you. Exactly, Elak Kaval. What is the difference? Tell me the difference. Where's the lie? Where's the lie, chat? Where's the fucking lie? Oh, God. Yeah, I think these are supposed to be solar panels. Bitch, if you can find somebody to build you an entire building out of solar panels for $500, we need to have a talk. You need to, you need to get on the phone with Joseph Biden. Joseph Robinette Biden. He could probably do an entire Green New Deal on, on a fucking budget. And remember, <clears throat> building a city for all people of color to be free, no discrimination of nationality, gender, age, mental, physical differences, etc. Unless you're Jewish, unless you're Jewish, if you're Jewish, uh, uh oh, jobs, housing, food, health care, no cops, no rent, no coronavirus, and no white people. Returning the land to indigenous people via our organization. Building the first Hammer City for $500,000. <sighs> oh 
Oh, it really has, Morg Porg. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Morg Porg. Appreciate it. Oh, they're still accepting don donations. Yes, they are. In fact, if you head over to their social media, let me bring it up real quick. Let me let me show you something. Let me show you a little something. Uh oh. So this was just a couple days. Let's see. Let's see what they've been talking about recently. Let's see. Let's take a look. Well, okay, two hours ago they were tweeting this. Hey, let's check in and see what they've got here. Ah, yes. Oh, how nice. Greta Lamberg falsely claimed China Daily for fat shaming after being called out on her lies. Um, shall we take a listen? Here, I have to hold on to do this. Oh, my setup is a little fucked. So hold on a second. I have to bring this up over here. Give me just a second. Let's do it. Here we go. Oh, oh, nice. Actually, you know what's even better than this? Hold on a second. Let's take a listen, shall we? Hold on. How do I do this? Hold on. Okay, y'all. I already told you that Greta Thunderbird is a dope drug dealer. She's giving you dope. And I told you they was going to use her as an as a imperial ploy. And already... Already, she she not even had her period yet, but she making everybody bleed all over the world through uh through uh you know signing on to nukes and signing on to drones and bombs and attacks all over the world. You is attacking uh, China. You got nothing to do. What she know about China? And this is this is perfect for the goddamn uh, that snowflake uh, politic. Like oh, I know there's no video. I know. That. And I think that whole politic of like don't call me this, don't say that. Oh my god, that's so bad. Da, 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 da. That that comes against you know a lot of these communist uh uh what we call it liberated countries because they they'll call a thing a thing and they'll cuss you out. Okay, well as you can see, Black Hammer is not exactly the most grounded of organizations. Hey, but look at this. Greta K K Kunberg really got China on her mouth when it's her homeland, Europe, that's responsible for the destruction of our Earth. Why is she not calling for an end to U.S. and European imperialism and militarism? China is now threatening to crack down on the crypto market, which has sent the American crypto market, the American crypto market into a crash. Let's talk about it. Oh, uh oh. Wait a second. Hold on a second. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a second. Black Hammer also accepts Bitcoin and Ethereum. Huh. What? Wait, wait a second. Wait a minute. Whoopsies. Whoopsies. Hmm. Where is the c c colonizer's place in the revolution? It's under the leadership of colonized people. Join us for this panel May 31st at 6 p.m. to meet several reparations corps recruits. This guy, listen, this guy's name is Recruit A. That is some kink shit if I've ever seen it, okay? A guy who renames himself to Recruit A. Listen, that's some, that's some fucking hardcore dehumanization. Who boy. Who boy.
if you're not willing to sell out your people and uphold these colonial structures, you're done by the colony. Understanding that colonial university is built of the death of your people, nothing diverse will give us hope or liberation. Doesn't matter if you have a colonizer who's nice to you. They have a whole white supremacy apparatus behind them. With one to call the cops on you, you're dead. That's the difference between a colonizer and a colonized person. Chief Itza. Chief Itza is one of their people. One of their teammates. They got their quotes. So yeah, they're they're basically acting like nothing's happened. Uh, it just keeps going. The goal of our re Reparation Corps recruits will be to raise 50,000 in reparations by the end of summer 2021 to further anti-colonial revolution worldwide. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Let's find out. Let's find out. <clears throat> oh, boy. Oh, boy. Let's see. Oh, no! Oh, no! It's stolen, too! Oh, no! Self-replicating eco-communities. One community global. Earth bag village. Perimeter shrubs. One community global. This is stolen, too! Look! That's their image! They just rotated it! Now this is what I call drama journalism! It's a fraud all the way down! It's, is this like a water park? Oh no, it's, the uh, the artist has, oh no, the bubble palace. Oh no, no. Oh no, no, no. Oh Jesus, let's see. There it is. They did. Hold on, let's see. This is stolen. This is somebody else's design. This is somebody else's design. Dan Alec, designer and illustrator, completed his 36 week helping with Earth Bag Village render editions. This week he worked on improving the colors and perimeter plants in view of the complete village looking north. I guess it was okay because he's white, right? Right? I guess it's all right because he's white. Right? That's how it works. Oh my fucking God. This shit is gold. Yeah! One community pod one. This is it. This is the one. People put a lot of work into this. Oh my God. And they didn't even use the good, the best quality. They just stole it. Can be constructed for under 7,000 per living structure. How many are there? 72 living units. Hold on a second. There it is. That's why the text is so weird. We love it. We love it. Oh, God. Hold on. Let's see. So, just so you know. Here we go. 504000 is the minimum cost to just build the living structures. According to the original creator of it. 7000 for just the living structures. Not, not anything else. 7,000 each, which puts it at 504,000 just for the living structures, nothing else for the solar panels, nothing else for everything else. Oh. 
I wonder where this was designed to be built at. Hold on, let's see. Labor intensive. Designs are not for everyone. The feeling of living in a cave. Oof. Uh oh. They have heat, heating, and cooling issues. Do you think that you're going to have issues with heat and cooling on top of a mountain? Uh oh. Oh. Oh no. Oh no! There's look at all this information is here, and none of this was shared on their fucking website. They just stole it. This is a fucking scam. This is a mega scam. Look! Wait! Look! Estimated cost. Estimated cost 849000 to build the whole village. That's not even including the land. Okay, ready? Here we go. Watch. Here's what we're going to do. Ready? Here we go. This is for the Clipsters. Here you go. Build Hammer City, huh? Uh-oh. What? Oh, no. What is this? Oh, Stolen designs? Stolen uncredited art? Oh, oh, and look at that estimated cost. Oh shit, that's a lot more than what they're asking for. Almost seems like this entire organization is a giant motherfucking scam. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. This is outrageous. <sighs> Breaking news about Scam Hammer brought to you by the one and only Demon Mama. Like and subscribe, motherfuckers. I ain't bringing you a revolution. I'm just bringing you revolutionary streaming entertainment. Brought to you by viewers like you, always viewer supported. And if you donate right now at the ten thousand dollar tier, you can have the uh, you can have a a Bakunin tier. Oh, you could have a uh, you can have a Biden tier. Ten thousand dollars will get you into the true tier, the most greatest revolutionary of all time, the Biden Robinette, the Joseph Robinette Biden tier. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Uh-oh, what we got here? <laughs> this is what our city will look like upon completion once we have ousted all of the colonizers. Once we have ousted all of the colonizers, truly, we will arrive in Black Hammer Neotopia. You will have more fucking coins than you know what to do with. You will be able to buy all the pet pets. But don't you fucking, don't you fucking dare come, de d come, come to Neo Neotopia with your bourgeois Anne Frank, diary of Anne Franks. Yeah. All right, everybody. Thank you very much, Brim. That was fun. That was really fun. Nah, that was fun. This is going to be a bomb segment.